our world there's animals all around and you have questions can you down ranger ray is here to show by talking to those animal pros at the critter calm we see the world a new adventure will unfold you will become an animal champ here at ranger ray's animal camp <laughs> Hello there, everyone, and welcome back to Ranger Ray's Animal Camp. I'm your host, Ranger Ray, and today we have a roaring mystery on our hands. Why do tigers have stripes? I mean, they are beautiful, but do they serve a purpose? Well, with that, let's pounce on into this world of big cats. And without further ado, let's head to the Crittercom. So let's go. Well, hey there, Crittercom. Yes, almost to a high score. Uh, Crittercom? Oh, Ranger Ray! What, what's going on? Is our ten minute break over? Yeah, it was over like 30 minutes ago. Oh, dash it all, got a game over. Uh, anyways, my bad, Ranger Ray, what, what, what's going on? Well, we need help answering the question, why do tigers have stripes? Oh, an absolutely perfect question. <laughs> yeah, so can you call Thomas the Tiger for us? Thomas it is! Yes? Hey Thomas, it's Ranger Ray and Crittercom here. Ah, if it isn't my favorite duo, how are you two? We're great, thanks for asking. But we have a question for you. Why do tigers have stripes? Mind sharing your expertise with us? Of course I'd be delighted to share. Here, let me show you. Tiger stripes serve multiple purposes in our wild world. Multiple purposes? Do tell! Well, first, the stripes act as camouflage. In the dense forests and tall grasses, our stripes help us blend in with the shadows in sunlight, making it easier to stalk prey since they cannot see us well. So it's like nature's own stealth suit. How clever. You got it. But that's not all. The unique stripe pattern is like a fingerprint for each tiger. No two tigers have the same pattern which helps us recognize each other in the wild. And it's also not just the stripes on our bodies, but we also have special markings on our ears. They look almost like eyes, which we use to scare off would-be attackers from sneaking up on us. And we can also move around our ears. We use that to signal our cubs what to do while moving through the jungles and grasslands to keep them safe. So it's not just about blending in but it's also about standing out. Precisely. And one more thing, those stripes aren't just on our fur, they're also on our skin. If you were to shave a tiger, you'd still see the stripe pattern on our skin. That's wild. So it's not just a fur fashion statement. Can you tell us some more about tigers? Absolutely. Did you know that we tigers are the largest cats in the whole world? Wow! Even larger than lions and leopards and jaguars? Yes, we are the biggest. And also, most people know that cats don't like water. But we tigers love the water. We go swimming all the time. And did you also know that our roars are very powerful? They can even be heard almost two miles away. Ah, oh, this has been amazing. Thank you so much, Thomas, for all your help. Anytime, Ranger Ray. Ta-ta. So tigers use their stripes to blend in while they hunt. They also use their stripes to identify each other, and even certain markings can be used to communicate with cubs. Isn't that amazing? Yes, it is, Ranger Ray. Now, if only I could blend in like a tiger so I could play more video games. What was that last part? Oh, nothing. So thank you guys so much for joining us on this adventure today. Remember, stay wonderful and wild, and we'll see you guys next time. Goodbye! Ta-ta!